Hi and hello and welcome back to the channel. In this video we're going to be discussing the 10 best hidden gems to play in 2022 as they are amazing and beyond expectation. Speaking of the latter, players on Steam now have more gaming alternatives thanks to the consistent stream of titles from smaller developers. However, many low quality games routinely slip gamers notice due to the issue of number over quality which also exists at this time. But without further ado, let's get into the list starting with number 10, Neon White. In a minor but significant sense, Neon White is also a deck building card game. In the time it took you to hear this sentence, your friend has just surpassed your record once more. So if this was a smoothie, I would be equally sweet, tangy, filling and also flowing down your face. Neon White is a game about hopping from one platform to another so it's quite an accomplishment that it can be graceful and simple while still instilling such potent resentments and miserably constricted wrists. Number 9. Thumper. Thumper is a game where you have to combine the thrill of terror and the accuracy of rhythm games. Players control a beal as it travels through its fantastical universe while dodging obstacles in this drool. Creation. Players must grind, jump and dash their way through levels while being accompanied by a rumbling background music and neon lights. The game periodically presents new mechanics to the players further putting their reflexes to the test. There are no other games like this one on Steam regardless of what players think of the title. Number 8. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge Shredder's Revenge is a fantastic homage to a number of classic games since it's noisy and chaotic without even being obtrusive. Although it's only a little game, there is a lot of value in playing through the levels again and perfecting each character's moves because there are 7 different characters, the 4 turtles plus April O'Neil, Splinter and Casey Jones. While remaining true to the forebears, it is unmistakably modern offering more thrilling combat versus armies of hostile warriors and character enhancements on top of that. Number 7. Strange Brigade Strange Brigade combines third-person gameplay with an Egyptian mythology-based environment that is reminiscent of a B-movie. The Strange Brigade is called in to clean up the mess left behind by the savage queen, Sedesky's soul, after escapes from her resting tomb. The Brigade, a team of experienced explorers, is outfitted with a range of weapons to defeat the armies of evil. The developer's own Zombie Army trilogy game served as inspiration for the game. As a result, it's also a cooperative experience that lets up to four players battle it out against zombie enemies, puzzles and traps. Number 6. The Quarry the Quarry, like supermassive past games, lets you take control of a group of people. In this case, it's 9 camp counselors who are stuck at the camp for an extra night. They have to explore their surroundings and try to stay alive while doing it. It's a testament to supermassive skill that it can make a search for duffel bags as compelling and terrifying an encounter with otherworldly creatures, an innocent kiss as monotonous a decision as pulling a trigger, even though player input is almost entirely limited to walking, binary character choices and quick time events. Oh, almost totally forgot to hit you up with a new drill. If you found any game on the list that interests you, please don't feel shy to like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and share this video with your friends and your crush too if you have one. But I digress, so let's get back to the list. Number 5. Get Even Get Even is a 2017 Steam release of a first person psychological thriller. On the orders of the enigmatic red, players take on the role of Cole Black and navigate the way through a deserted asylum for the insane. Players can engage with the prisoners, many of whom are hostile by the way, while armed with guns and a camera. Killing is discouraged in the game because it emphasizes stealth and non lethal playstyle, and doing so can result in penalties. Who's that? Take him out! Number 4. Savant Ascent. The strong alchemist, a mechanical wizard attempting to harness the power of the mysterious orb, is controlled by the players. He has the ability to fire magic missile volleys that are effective against waves of opponents that are spawning. Savant contributed music to the game which players may collect in the form of 6 golden discs that also give them additional skills. Players must climb the tower and battle the foe perch atop. Number 3. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe the most popular video game of 2022 is the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. You take on the role of an office drone who breaks up the monotonous days of data entry to explore a fascinating office building that spreads out like the pages of a choose your own adventure novel. But then you come upon new content trademark. It is a sequel, it is an autopsy, it is a sarcastic parody of commercialization of video games, the aesthetic restrictions of intellectual property mining and its audience tested contemporaries intent on games as a service. Number 2. War Groove. Advance War and Fire Emblem, two venerable Nintendo series, are both influences on Wargroove. The Undead Felheim Legion will surely invade newly crowned Queen Mercia. The gameplay takes place on various levels, each with its own goals and constraints. There are numerous troops under your command, including exceptional individuals with specific skills. Each unit is weak to a different type of opponent and battles take place on a grid battlefield. Those who are eagerly anticipating the release of Advance Wars, remake for the Nintendo Switch, may want to check this one out. And number 1. Deathspank. 
A swirling environment and chic fusion of 3D and 2D elements give Death Spank's world a unique vibe that gamers have never experienced before. The epic humor of Ron Gilbert in one of the most epic tales ever told about a hero and his search for the artifact. Ron Gilbert brings his amazing brand of sharp humor and ludicrous speech to a completely new genre. You know the plan that me and the boys are cooking up, right? And that's it for today's video. We hope you liked some of these games that we mentioned on the list. And if we missed anything, don't forget to mention in the comment section below. And if you want to get the latest games, news, and top lists, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon, or we will patch you. Or, and I mean this, we, we will, will patch, patch you. you.